Hi, I'm Rebecca Brand, and I'm mowing my lawn. Well, I'm not mowing, my Sunseeker is. This robotic lawnmower is my favorite friend and toy for the summer. It automatically mows my lawn, so I don't have to. This is Sunseeker Robotic Lawnmower Model L, and it knows what to do, so I don't even have to tell it. It knows when it hits the edge of the lawn, it's just gonna swivel because I put electric fencing all around my lawn to make sure it knows its little playpen where it should be mowing. It goes right to the edge of its perimeter and then it'll turn around and come back to do the rest of the lawn. So you can just leave your sun seeker in your lawn mowing while you go in the house and do other things better in life than mowing your lawn, which is what I often do. Mowing lawn is a really big task in my life. I have a very huge lawn in my backyard. It's ginormous. It is so expensive to mow my lawns because they're so big. I've got the one in the backyard that you see here, and I also have my lawn in the front yard, which is smaller and contained. And that's the one I've used for this video today to show you the features of the Sunseeker. Because my back lawn is so large and it's so expensive to get it cut, often it grows really out of hand. And I get lots of little flowers and weeds and everything else growing here because I just can't keep up on lawn mowing. In the past, I've had to have a gardener on a tractor mow my lawn. Well, that tractor often breaks. There's so much maintenance on the tractor. And of course, hiring the person to mow the lawn. It's very expensive to hire a gardener for lawn care. My backyard lawn is not quite a half an acre, and this Model L, the Sunseeker, will mow from one quarter to one half an acre. My front lawn is much smaller, so I wanted to set it up in a contained area for this video. Here it is in fast motion, working hard to cut my front lawn. As we look down on the lawn, there's a perimeter that I installed, and on that perimeter, the lawnmower knows to go up to that and then turn around and keep going around. Just because you might have rocks or some other kind of landscaping, you don't want your lawnmower getting into trouble in some other terrain. You wanna keep it just where your lawn is. And for this demonstration, I kept it a little bit within the barriers, which will mean I'm gonna to have to weed eat around that edge, but that's okay. I'd have to weed eat anyways. And check out the pattern of the Sunseeker as it mows this lawn. It knows not to wander off and go into other terrains you don't want it to cut. It stays right on your lawn because you've set it with a perimeter fencing. Now this is a flat lawn, but it also could climb up to a 20 degree incline or angle and seamlessly mow uneven terrain. That's because the wheels are anti-slip. It's made for that. Sunseeker has designed this robotic motor with an automatic float cutting technology. Now that raises or lowers the blades when it's hitting the rough patches. On my lawn, you can see I've had gophers. It can accommodate those gopher mounds. Check this out. It's going right around those brown patches. Those are the gopher mounds. It is able to go up and down and around those without me having to flatten those out every time I want to mow my lawn. This part of my lawn, oh, I don't know, maybe it's a 10 degree incline, but you get the picture. It can go up to 20 degrees in the slope and still keep working and cutting. It has three razor sharp blades underneath as it's cutting, and that will cut a width of about nine inches with every path it takes. And you can see the pattern of the cutting as we watch it cut my lawn. There's an adjustable dial on the top of the Sunseeker robotic lawnmower. And with that, you can adjust the height of the lawn it's cutting between 1.6 inches to 3.2 inches because different varieties of grass look better cut lower or higher. And depending on how much you water your lawn or how much rain you get, you might want to adjust the level of where it cuts your lawn. Lawns in drought stricken areas tend to do better with longer blades of grass. And as a Sunseeker robotic lawnmower cuts your lawn, the grass clippings are gonna fall right back into the grass. And that is great for natural mulching to provide nutrients to the ground. And that means over time, you're gonna have a greener, healthier yard because you've reused the grass clippings as natural mulch for your lawn. And it also has an ultrasonic technology and that's gonna sense obstacles. Here I am holding a big pot with a plant in it. I'm gonna put that right in front of my sun sinker and look it, it's gonna stop. It's not gonna go, it's gonna go around that pot. It's not gonna bump into the pot. Just in case you might have a big rock in your front yard or in your landscaping. 
you don't have to worry about that. It's not going to get damaged by running into rocks in your landscaping or other things that you have. Trees, tree trunks, kids' toys, or any other object that's big in your yard. I also wanted to show you the bumper. If you hit the bumper, it'll stop and it'll move other ways. So I hit the pot on the side of it just to show you. It's going to find another way around if the bumper gets bumped. It will safely twist and turn and keep mowing after it bumps the bumper on something. Sunseeker has thought about safety. Safety is their number one priority. So if you were to pick it up, it automatically turns off. It also will auto stop if it's flipped, tilted, or senses a collision. Every mower includes its own pin code for security, and that makes it anti-theft. No one's gonna get away and have any fun with your lawnmower. So you can feel comfortable leaving it right in the front yard of your house like I am.